Mark here. Uh, in this video, I'm going to do an accumulation of my Zappa, Frank Zappa stuff. Now, because of where I live, which is between D.C. and Baltimore, I usually did my um, hunting for music in the Baltimore suburbs. And Frank Zappa was pretty popular around here. I call this an accumulation, even though at some point I probably owned at least one of every single thing he had. Frank Zappa is an extremely acquired taste. I did not have a taste for him when I first started buying records. So even though I bought, um, you know, just people's collections and stuff like that, I would just get rid of the Frank Zappas. And I acquired a bit more of a taste and decided to start keeping them. So this is what I have left, in other words. And if I find more, of course, I'll pick them up, at least if they're at a decent price. All right, so the first one is... We're only in it for the money. And I believe this is a gatefold. Well, it's a gatefold that's falling apart. And yeah, it's, it sure is falling apart. Okay, so there's that. And there's that. There's the back, the front. And I'm not even gonna bother opening the gatefold again because this thing is falling apart. Uh, it's on Verve Records. Okay, so that's we're only in it for the money. Next up is another one that's in ratty shape, and that's Uncle Meat. So there's the front. There's the gatefold. This is two discs. It was two discs and a 12-page book. I didn't get the book. I got the records, the two records, but I didn't get the book. So front, back and I'll keep that here because I'm going to put the records back. It's Reprise Bazaar. So let me pull that out. So that's Reprise Bazaar. And that's two discs, like I said. No book. Put those back in here. Next up, Weasels Rip My Flesh. There's the front. This is not a gatefold. There is the back. Again, this is a reprise. The Weasels Ripped My Flesh. Up next, Zapped. There's the front. There's the back, and again, Reprise Bazaar. That one's in decent shape. Well, so was uh, Weasel's Rip My Flesh. That was in pretty good shape. The rest of them, I think, are. Um, Fillmore East, June 1971, Mothers. Here's the front. There's the back. And there's another one. So I've got two of those. Again, reprise, 50 cents. You know, I'm pretty sure I paid less than that. So again, front, back, record. The other one's over here. Put that back. Let's see, just another band from LA, The Mothers. And this one is a gatefold. The front, and the back, reprise. Just another band from LA. Okay, let's see. You see me pulling out three, so that means I have three. And this is Overnight Sensation. And so as you can see, I have three of them. So I'm not going to take the record out. I'm just going to show you that it just says Discreet. So this is Discreet. There's the front. There's the back. And... There's a gatefold. I don't know if I showed the gatefold though. Maybe. OK. 
Okay, so that's a gatefold. So put all three of those back. <coughs> like I said, I probably had every single one of them. And now I have duplicates of certain things. This is another discrete records. Two of these. Uh, this is apostrophe. So there's the back. There's the front. Decent amount of ring wear on both of them. And again, discrete records. This one's in better shape than this one. Okay, Roxy and Elsewhere. This is a gatefold, but it's not in a gatefold cover. And it's two discs, again on discrete. And a good amount of ring wear on that one too. Pull that out. Front, back. Fold. Yeah, it's not falling apart like the other ones were, but it does have a good chunk of ring wear on it, that's for sure. Alright, and then there's the two discs. And then discrete. I don't even think I'm going to bother putting that in the gatefold cover. Sometimes after some of these videos, if I realize it, then I'll set them aside and put them in a gatefold cover. This one I'm not going to. Okay, one size fits all. And this one is another gatefold. Front. And back's pretty cool. Both the front and the back are pretty cool pictures. And again, that's on discrete records. Put that back. Up oh, next, Zutelur. And this one's on Warner Brothers. And there's the front and the back. And that's Zoot Delors. And Warner Brothers. thinking about going into a rant on Baltimore because I have to drive into that damn city every day but I figure I'll just hold off on that that's not something you are probably interested in okay Zappa in New York another gatefold yes two discs there's the back discreet Titties and Beers, the first song in side one. All right, so that's Sap in New York. All right, next up, we have uh, Shake, Shake Your Booty. Shake Your Booty. So this is Shake Your Booty. So there's the front gatefold. And the back. Are you smoking a cigarette? I imagine it's either a cigarette or a joint. It looks more like a cigarette. All right, so there's that. And this is Zappa Records. Two discs. Those back. Joe's Garage is up next. Act one. So that's Joe's Garage, act one. And this is not a gatefold. Front and back. And that's on Zappa Records. And the last one that I have is Joe's Garage Acts 2 and 3. Okay, there's the front gatefold. Records out. And pink back. Back. Front. Two discs. Snap of records. So, anyway, 
uh, not not a collection but an accumulation and I figured I had enough to share so here I am sharing them or there I was sharing them it's done anyway hope you enjoyed the video um, more to come this is an odd Saturday uh, thing that I'm doing now so usually I do them on Sunday so I got more to do tomorrow but hope you enjoyed it if you did like comment subscribe the spiel anyway thanks hope you enjoyed again thanks bye